Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome to Dreams on the PS4 Pro. So this is the early access version of the game. Uh, it did just come out today. Uh, what we're looking at here is the like home menu. You can design all this yourselves. I haven't done anything. This is just the way it looks, guys. Uh, but yeah, you can design this whole whole place yourself. Though it is a little bit more limited than the regular, uh, you know, designing uh, area. Uh, however, we're not going to be checking any of this out. We're not going to be checking out the creation, uh, you know, aspect of the game. You know, any of the mechanics or anything like that. All we're going to be doing today is taking a look at other people's creations. Uh, I'm still kind of getting getting uh, the hang of all the creation stuff myself. I've done some of the tutorials, but yeah, I'm definitely not in a place where I feel comfortable <laughs> showing off your skills <laughs> attempting to make anything just yet uh, so yeah we're gonna check out other people's creations including some of the creations done by uh, some of the developers of the game uh, so I guess we'll just hop into this uh, well, I guess we'll hop into the kids favorite game first <laughs> the hug me they love this game I don't know why uh, I mean it's a it's a it's sad it's a sad little game um, they really like it Wait, he just wants a fucking hug. he just wants a fucking hug just said please hug and he me he says please <laughs> and nobody will fucking hug Aww. him. Poor little guy. So you do want to make sure that you get all of these guys off. I left one guy over there and I had to run all the way back across this big orange <laughs> thing. Because the game's not over until you and, push everyone away. Until every single person in your life is pushed away. So, it's so sad. sad. So all these game, everything that we're going to be showing you guys today, all these games, were created with the in-game creation tools uh, so yeah you can do quite a bit with it uh, obviously this isn't a good example of all the things you can do uh, but yeah it's an interesting little little game I had to show you guys that we'll start with that and let's take a look at the, what we're gonna do is I want to show like some of like the most popular games uh, the ones with the highest thumbs up uh, and all the ones with the M's I want to say are made by media mm, molecule yeah. so the developers uh, so I guess we'll show off this one as well, because this is kind of, I think, their highest rated it's a one. Dash. Here. So we'll try it out. I haven't even played this one yet, guys. So this is probably going to go terrible. <laughs> All right, so we got to possess the little character. triangle. Or Let's go. Oh, and I, and I messed it up already? <laughs> go, go, go. Oh, Woo! oh, oh, snap. Oh, you got to be quick, quick, quick. Yeah, you do. And whoa. <laughs> no. I think I failed. No. Well, it's kind. Oh, kind of. Oops. It, it's Whoa. pretty forgiving. Bouncy balls. I love those. <laughs> but I mean, you're being timed, so I think that's like what the key yeah. here is. So y you could definitely do this like a lot more efficiently than I'm doing it, guys. I'm sure it takes a few runs. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Probably shouldn't run off right no, there either. No, probably shouldn't. Yeah, because all this is taking your time away. Jumping is hard, though. Well, this kind of shows you what you can do with the platforming. Mm-hmm. It definitely seems just like Little Big Planet. Like it probably is best designed. Oh, I did a flip. Whoa. Oh, I got some kind of special moves here. Super All right, so this cool. gives you the double. Oh, there's jump. a shortcut if you can go. And oh, that, that, that destroys kills you, you. Apparently. All right, I wasn't aware of that. Yeah, I don't know <laughs> which way. <Nope>. Is... <laughs> Too skinny. I don't know which way is the quicker route. I guess it's not the quicker route if you. If you die a bunch. Wow. I guess that's why it's kind of hard <laughs> to. <you> go. <laughs> Okay, I gotta break through these motherfuckers. Uh -oh. oh no. <laughs> Blocks. Nemesis. My arch nemesis. Gotta time it just right. I hate squares. Get a zoomy. Whoa. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> yeah, but it's a pretty cool little thing. I don't know how long it would take to create something like this. Oh, I did terrible. I like the texture though. It has like a felt kind of feel to it. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. So we want to check it out again, guys. I could probably try and beat my time, I suppose. I wanted to, since that was kind of a garbage time. Uh, so this is PT. This was made by an actual, I think, one of the betas. And this is uh, based on that PT oh, game you have to, oh. that was made. I was about to say, do you have to get up in the morning and go... And go do PT in oh, the army? No. They're going to make you do a run? I'm going to read that first, Jinx. Watch out. The gap in the door. It's a separate reality. The only me is me. Are you sure the only you is you? I'm not sure. Whoa. Okay, this seems about right. Sun's not up yet. Gotta mm -hmm. get into her. And you get you got this can... this haze around you. Mm -hmm. You're like, oh, why is it? Because so you're early? in the army and you drank too damn much. That's true. 
This does not look like what the barracks look no, like. This is actually not. way nicer than barracks, actually. We're officers. Well, oh, well, nope. We're definitely in the <laughs> barracks. There's no question about that. Oh, it's almost hmm. midnight. All right. Guess we just had to. Whoa. Oh. What in the world? All right, so what this is, Jinx, because I don't. Do you know what PT is? No, I don't. So. I should probably turn this TV down just a notch. So PT was made to show off uh, the we just can't open any of these uh, the new Silent Hill game. It was like a demo, uh, and it had a uh, oh god, what's his name in it? Uh, the Walking Dead guy, uh, Daryl. Oh, okay. oh, did we finish it? I never hmm. actually played it, but it was a demo. It was just called PT, and then it reveals at the end that it, it was a demo for the the uh, Silent Hill game. But it got canceled. Oh no! And so then. Uh, God, what's his name? Uh, the guy who made the Metal Gear Solid game? Yeah. Uh, okay. Kojima? Yeah. So, yeah, he is now making that new, that new game with... Okay, yeah. With Daryl. All right, so you just keep doing it? <laughs> is there something so. I need to do that I'm not taking enough drugs? I don't know. Still the same time. I don't see anything I can interact with. I think we're putting a story uh, but together. I didn't actually play... And yeah, maybe you have to listen to the story. I don't know. Somebody shot his wife. All right, uh, but that's that. We're just gonna be flying through these, just kind of checking out some of the some of the most popular ones. The off-road lands. Oh right, yeah, we'll check that out. It seems almost like they eliminate it from your list once you've played it. I don't know. Which kind of sucks because there's a couple here that I wanted to show off that we did play. Uh, but yeah, I guess we'll check out this one. It's got 5,700 something. 5,900. Maybe there's a way that you can sort to pull up the ones that you've played before. Yeah, I bet there is. Yeah, I'm sure there is. Maybe we'll take a look at some of those. Eventually. That's a cutie little amp. I like the art style. Oh, yeah. Very, very nice. Are we in a car? Vroom, vroom. Oh, okay, we're in the car. <laughs> I thought it was a loading screen. Yeah, this is a You know you gotta honk the horn. Of course. All right, so <laughs> it's the, they got the imp driving, too. Kind of cool. Let's go down so this way. I like the tunes. Yeah, the tunes are nice. Oh, Whoa. uh oh. Oh, I like how it nice. leaves a little, yeah. yeah, little marks on the ground. Because remember, everything in here was created by somebody, guys, which is really cool. Yeah, I'm digging the the yeah. art style. Yeah. Just grooving. <laughs> they got a nice bridge here as well that I can't seem to get across. You're too fat. <laughs> Oh, no. Just large enough for us for the perfect fit, and it is foggy. foggy. Oh, that's it. Okay. Or maybe that moves us to the next levels. It's a loading screen. Can you put loading screens in your game? I am true. I assume you would be able to. Oh, okay. I can't see a Whoa. fucking thing. Oh, you took a wrong turn at Albuquerque. Burst through there. Oh, it's snowy. It is like really slippery. I don't know if that's like yeah. an intentional mechanic since I it's, think so. it's snowy. I think the last area was like that too. It's telling you that you need to be careful. Can I burst through? Full speed ahead. Ah. Hmm. All right, so we're safe and warm. This is our house. Luckily, it fits our car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but something like this, guys, I can't imagine. Like it, it's so, like it seems like it's pretty basic in a way, but I can't imagine how long something like this took for them to create well yeah because you got to design everything the whole mm -hmm. world i mean you can you can clone things and make copies of it and pull stuff from other people pull games. people from other stuff there, there are a lot of mechanics that kind of allow you to do things a little bit quicker oh this is beautiful Whee. oh shit just got weird all right i have no idea what we're supposed Game to do over, next man. oh, oh. Got back up into his mouth. <laughs> uh, guys, let's go this way. Well, it even leaves the tire marks mm -hmm. if you're not in a terrain. Maybe, yeah, maybe that's just applied it's to the vehicle. Brown. Yeah, the vehicle just always leaves Ooh, tire marks. Scary. Oh, skulls. I need to just run into it. Yep. Oh, that's cool. A sword? Nice, a sword and a stone. Is this like a collection of Disney themed things? I'm getting a little bit of Alice in Wonderland okay. now. Okay. All right. I don't know. Super if psychedelic. Three statues were. 
I think somebody's just literally doing just doing mushrooms. What... <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is beautiful, though. Like I love shrooms. Mm-hmm. They're so beautiful. Got the rainbow shrooms or inclusive here. Did you know that like growing mushrooms is like a thing? What do you mean? Like growing the different kinds of mushrooms and for like cooking and mm -hmm. all that. Well, I mean, like, I wanna... somebody's got to grow them. No, James. I know, but like a hobby, you oh, know. Wow, that's really pretty. I guess we're just supposed to jump off. Game over, man. Oh, I landed on this Ice? area here. Well, we're apparently I wasn't supposed to land on it. <laughs> Now it's a boat. Oh. I need to get one of these. Whitewater rafting, Jinx. <laughs> Alright. Well, the Army's got some pretty cool vehicles that can go on land. And, yeah, I guess Marines does too. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, car death. No, don't go. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is our family, Jinx. There's Uncle Bob over there and cousin Jimbo. I don't know why I'm making them all like southern yeah. names, but some southerners gonna get irritated. We don't name our people Bob and Jimbo. They damn sure do. Chase is from the south, so I'm just going off of this based on my experience with being married to a southern. <laughs> like, what do they mean? All right, so that's it. I would <laughs> say deserves this thumbs deserves up. a thumbs up. I thought that was quite quite well done. I'm gonna make some games someday. Yeah, Jinx and I are both really excited to make some of our own games. I did want to take a look at, can you see like past games that you created? Categories. I think that would be, maybe. I mean, that's like story yeah, and stuff. True. Yeah, I want to see if there's any way to see like the past games you played. Maybe most recent. Oh, that's mm -hmm. the ones just by yeah. recently created. Here's the thumbs up ones. Okay, so yeah, these are some of the ones that we've we played here. There's that curiosity one. The cool little robot that they made there, you pretty much just run forward on that one, so we won't won't take a look at that. This is a first person shooter created. Now It's okay. I mean if you're you're comparing it to like first person shooters, you know, made that you'd play today, mm -hmm. it's obviously, you know, not great. But I mean, considering the fact that this was just somebody created this in their house, one person probably. I don't know how long it took them to create this, but I think it was pretty well done. And I, I, I'm not gonna talk shit because I need to create probably yeah. worse. <laughs> I like the floaty gun. Yeah, That's how it floats favorite. in your hand. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of the best part of the game, I feel. And if I could go arms in my garden, that would be great. Yeah, That'd probably yeah, I'm be the only the thing that I could grow in a garden. <laughs> I think what happened is maybe they didn't group the the gun with the hand right or something i don't know because i've seen fps games in this you know uh game uh, i've seen videos of it where the gun does fit in the hand properly so or maybe they just like floaty guns too oh gosh. shoot it's coming after me so we can't aim down the sights all right as well so they got that mechanic can't in there loot em. there's no loot or anything like that I don't think there's any way to put your health up either, though. I didn't really look at those controls in the beginning. You should have tried so. eating his flesh. Mm-hmm. That's probably the way you do it. I mean, how else would you really? Woo. That's how I always get new health. I it's need like, it. Moral of the story, don't wear slippery socks when you're a bad guy. <laughs> <laughs> On smooth stone surfaces. <laughs> All right, so that's that's this game. We can continue to take a look at it. I'm a little worried that playing of FPS will get Jinx sick, though, so... I don't want to play too much of it. We'll just kill this guy. If I just focus on the floaty gun, does his fine. does his finger move when he's pulling the trigger? <laughs> I think everything's moving. No, I'm saying like it looks like the know, like he's trigger finger is moving. Sorry about the loud cars going Maybe by. Not though. It is that time for us guys, uh, where all the cars, everybody's coming home from work and stuff, all that kind of good stuff. So that's Prometheus. That's the main one I wanted to show that we had played. Dark. Dungeons. All right, so what we'll do is we'll go back to this and then just keep on going through here. It looks like they restored them. All right, awesome. Uh, so I guess we can go into Dark Dungeon next. It's a Dark Souls inspired scenery. Scenery, excuse me. Nice. It says forty-three hundred thumbs up. Do we get to just chill in the Dark Souls world? Because I've so. never done that before. <laughs> I, th I, I think you're just walking around. Oh, oh, you're not even walking. 
Not even moving. Oh, it's a ride. Yeah. So okay. this engine uh, can be used for, for more. I guess that's what you'd call it. It's not really an engine. This game creation, to, mm -hmm. you know, tools. It's a tool. Yeah. They can be used for, for creating more than just games. I mean, you can create movies with them. Uh, you can create uh, music videos because you can do your own music in here. A little animated film. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff you can do. We're pretty excited to jump into it, guys, because I'm a really creative person. That's why I've always modded. Uh, I really like being able to create things, so I'm excited to jump in this. I'm artsy. Yep, and Jinx is the artsy one. Please hug me. And when I say I'm creative, I'm creative in a different way. Like, I'm not, uh, I'm not artsy. I can't draw. <laughs> I can't play any instruments. It's not really what I do. Oh, a puzzle. All right, so. Oh. I, see. I didn't know I was getting involved in a puzzle. Mm -hmm. All right, so we need to go to the, we, we'll start with the, the red. Because we know that that goes right there. Okay. And then from there, we can then connect all the other ones. That makes sense. I want to say I just rotated that in a way that probably should be that one, right? Maybe not. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, okay. This one goes down here. Got it. Right? It there. all makes sense. I don't know how close you got to get it. And then this would connect to these two. There you go. And we open the book. Wow. Well, this is freaking neat. All right, so can I turn the pages? Somebody drew that. Okay, I guess that's it's what it was. It was a puzzle. All right, well, so yeah, well done, I feel. I did enjoy that. That was nice. I think it was a cool little puzzle they did, even if it was kind of, you know, it wasn't challenging. Uh, let's see what else we want to do. Oh, this one's got two players, Jinx. I don't have my controller. Yeah, we don't have the other controller hooked up right now. I think it's still hooked up to the other PlayStation, so if you turn it on, yeah. <laughs> you'll turn the other PlayStation on. Okay, we'll take a look at it, though. See what they did here. Oi, you, what you looking at? All right, so we got a punch. Oh, it's boxing It's rock'em sock'em. All right, you can do a hook or just a regular old punch, I guess. Oh, you, what you looking at? What's up to <laughs> This is great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm loving it. I think I'm losing to the AI, though. He's clearly better than me. That's how I feel. Look at him rocking out. <laughs> There's not enough kicks, though. What you Got, oh, the gyro is All right, so you can like I'm sorry, dodge I'm it. Be <laughs> it's gonna be stuck in my head all day. Hey, I think I'm losing to the so air. I start right singing now. the song. You know what time it is. <laughs> can I push him off the edge? Get off. I think that's my health up there. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna so be jinxed. Oh, low blow! Yeah, I punched that's him in the car. wrong, but it seems like there's no rules. I don't know. It was turned red. Oh, it's telling you where you hit him. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna lose. I'm pretty sure my health is like down to nothing. He's better I than even, me. Are I think you the gray this, guy? I'm the blue one. Oh, okay. I guess I'm both blue, but the dark blue. Yeah. I the one with it. no health left. <laughs> the one that's about to oh, die. Oh, that one. Yeah. I'm trying not to lose, guys, but I'm pretty sure I'm done for. <laughs> Damn. Knock me the fuck out. Anyway. I think the problem was I was just like swinging wildly. What else are you supposed to do? <laughs> I think you gotta be dipping in stuff. I wasn't I wasn't oh, dipping, Jinx. Okay. I didn't do enough dipping. Alright, so this is one I haven't played. I kinda saved it for the video because it seems super interesting, Space. at least visually pleasing. Is it Star Fox? Alright, so use Alright. Uh yeah, we're fine with inverted since it's looks like it's a flying game. Nice menu. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and you can create all of that for your games, which is really cool. Whoa. Oh, shit. So, yeah, this one was obviously created by the developers. Not entirely sure how I get out of here. Oh, square. Take off. All right, so we are Whoa. fine. So, we're not going to be able to play this one very long either. Just these kind of games always make Jinx super sick. I, I think I think somebody is on my six, Jinx. They're locked on. I should have paid attention on to your the tail. controls. <laughs> Do I have missiles? Or do I just I blast? How do they, they lock it on? I know. All right, so here's the, oh. Whoa. We got a boost. It's super fast. All right, what we need to do is take a look 
at the controls. Oh, nice. All right, so R2 to boost, and then we can do a roll. Do a barrel roll. Hey, we gotta do it. We gotta do a barrel roll. How do we not? Do a barrel roll. Oh, that's the barrel roll. Oh, I died. Oh, no. I died while barrel rolling. So we can do a cockpit view as well. Oh, there's only five left. There was only five in the beginning, James. Oh, I haven't okay, killed a gotcha. single enemy yet. Well, we didn't have to talk about all that. But you did. <laughs> you did talk about it. You talked about my garbage nest, Jinx. Oh, no. We I think you can keep playing. One down. Until you get them all destroyed. I don't think it restarts. It could be wrong, though. Oh, I thought they did a barrel roll. He was trying to do a barrel. He failed. Uh, just blast over to him. Yeah, this one's cool. Yeah, I think they did a pretty cool job with this. And this, once again, even though this one was made by developers, these are all things that you can make in your games. I love, like, getting ideas. Mm-hmm. And what they do, and you can take their games as well. And then, uh, like modify, modify them. them. Yeah. yeah. Take stuff from them. Seems kind of like a slippery slope, especially considering the fact that they're trying to find out ways where you can earn money off your games. Yeah. It seems like it's going to be one of those things that's going to cause issues, like if I create something. But you can always tell people whether or not they can use it or not. Yeah, I think they have to have, like, credit. Like, I think if cert if you use certain items from, uh -huh. from people who require that, then the credit will be, um, you know, required for you to use that item. Yeah, but what if, can they say, I don't want you using it? And if they do say they want credit, does that mean they get a percentage of your money once that becomes mm, a thing? True. If it ever does. Yeah. It's something they're working with PlayStation, uh, so we're not sure if they'll ever get it done. Like I said, it does seem like it might be a little bit challenging to figure out, and then you're going to get, like, lawsuits, especially if any of these games start making, like, real money. Which I could see people making some some really, really complex awesome. stuff. Really awesome and amazing games. Because people have so much time. Like, look at what people make. I don't know if that's health. I'm trying to get it. I missed it. Uh, look at what people create in games like, I don't know, The Sims or just mods for the type of games I play yeah, or all strategy stuff games. Yeah, people or, did in Little Big Planet. Yeah. You know, you got people that have nothing but time on their hands. They're going to be playing a video game anyways. And how many people have, you know, always wanted to make a video game, but they this don't? Guy? The tools are either too expensive oh, or too complex to learn. Yeah, I've always wanted, I've, that's why I started modding, because I always wanted to create, you know, something that I would enjoy. Like, for instance, I love Paradox games. I love them, but, man, sometimes I think their game philosophy is off from what I like. I know that not what I like isn't what everybody else likes, uh, but, like, I feel like they deviate from history a bit too much. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, so it took me three minutes. I guess that's pretty sorry, but. <laughs> <laughs> what we've learned today is that I'm not great at these little games. <laughs> I guess I'll play the hammer game. It's hammer time. If they don't have the hammer time song playing or a hammer time song, they might not be able to use. A hammer time inspired song. Yeah, exactly. Maybe you make your own music with the hammer. Maybe. Oh, do we have to beat on that thing? I think you do. Smash it. Oh, Oh, wow. we gotta go actually, like, do nails. Okay. Oh, it's a two-player game. Oh, yep, that's a shame. Damn, we should, if I knew that there were so many two-player games, I just thought that'd be kind of above more than yeah. what people would be doing. We would have had Jinx playing, too. I almost want to have her hook the... I don't know if I'm supposed fun. to smash those lamps. Yeah, smash the bulbs. Or, er, I call them lamps. Oh, okay. I'm the winner, Break by the way. Break everything. Oh. oh, nice. Can what I pick them up? Glowy bouncy ball. I think you have to bounce the ball into the opponent's target. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. I see. You're right. All right, so I'm blue, so I'd have to hit it over here. Ta da! Yeah, I really feel like. Such a, I mean, I guess it wouldn't be that difficult for you to hook it up. It would. It really would. Would it? <laughs> I think you just have to, like, plug it in, Jinx. <laughs> it's too difficult. All right. You win. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so good, guys. It's the only game I won today. <laughs> All right. So I don't want to play this as Jinx isn't playing with me. Polarity. Aw. Oh, I think we saw this one on one of the videos. With the little cutie guy. Mm-hmm. With the cutesy eyes. Well, I think it's supposed to be kind of like, uh, what's the name of that, that uh, movie? With the robot? Wally? Wally, yeah. <laughs> and it's not like Wally, I don't think, actually. Not like Wally at all. 
There is a game that's kind of Wally-ish that I saw in the videos. Press X oh. to repel from blue platforms. Your little magnet guy. Press circle to repel from red platform. Oh. Whee. That's pretty cool. That is cool. They added like different mechanics for that. All right, so how do I, can I like jump up from that? I don't think not. so. All right, so we'll try and repel up to there. <laughs> yeah, I am I'm liking this. I think they did a good job with it, though we did just die. <laughs> oh, almost died again. Yeah, because the camera is good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, oh, I can move it as well. Maybe I'm just not doing a very good job moving it. Oh, I didn't even see the blue one. Yeah, some of these are a little bit difficult to see. I'm guessing those are the checkpoints that we're hitting. It's kind of cool that you can Watch add checkpoints. Watch out check for points. lasers. I believe we can just repel up from it. It's serious. Lasers, Jinx. Lasers. Freaking lasers, man. Whoa. Ah. I'm liking the music, too. Yeah. Kind of got some, uh... I don't know. I don't know what game that's making me think of. Genesis Alpha 1. No, <laughs> no. No, it's actually just making me think of a movie. Man, lasers. Total recall. All right, so whatever block we're on. Oh, that's kind of tricky. Oh. oh. No. Yeah, this is a tricky part because yeah, you gotta like you gotta make sure you're brain. on. Oh, are you trying to say I don't have a brain? Jinx? No, I'm that's just saying right. colors are hard. <laughs> well, I think the biggest problem is that you don't know what block you're gonna be on when you get down. Yeah, I'm in a lot of trouble with this, guys. I need to like. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> just barely made it. We did it. Nice. It's the finish line right there, guys. I don't know if there's more than one level. Oh, we gotta go in here. You just barely fit. All right, we did it. You know what, I almost want to give this one a thumbs up. Can I do that from here, or am I already? Yeah, it looks I like I can play it again. No, oh, wait. there we go. Thumbs it up. I like that one. Ooh, the forest. I kind of want to give the hammer one a thumbs up too. I feel like it deserves a thumbs up as well. I mean, honestly, most of these probably deserve a thumbs <laughs> up, if I'm being fair. It's like all of them. All right, let's thumbs thumb that up, up as for well. everyone. All right, so we've got a forest. I guess we can try this one out. This like Zelda. I don't know. Is it's that gonna the, be tricky? Is it the name of the forest in Zelda? I've never played. Yeah, it is. It is uh, <laughs> oh so, God! So we, we're playing as Link. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> he hit puberty, Jinx, and he got a little bit weird. <laughs> he got all lanky. Uh huh. The voice is all changing and shit. Faces breaking out. Uh huh. And the environment is super cool, though. Yeah. They did a great job with it. And so I don't know what all you can do. I love that you got the little fairy thing. Isn't that something you have? I've never played any of the Zelda games outside of the first one. Oh, really? Well, remember when we, when you had that, that you had the 64 yeah, and you had one you, of them. You tried out Ocarina of Time. It was really difficult to like get back into something so old, guys. Because at this point, oh, is that it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. all right. So I guess those leave. Uh, I guess we'll go back and do it but at that point uh you know th that game was extremely old yeah so yeah i kind of had a little bit of difficulty the best. going back to a game that old uh, but yeah i just never really knew the nintendo games all that much uh, I'm, I'm just not a a big nintendo fan other than the the oldest nintendo uh consoles you know i had an nes mm -hmm. i never had a super nintendo but i had a lot of friends that had super nintendo so i did play a that ton was a of great it. console that was a great console uh, but I always just had the regular Nintendo, and I had that for a long time. And then I got a Sega Genesis, and that kind of became my console for a while. Yeah, like my cousin had a Sega Genesis, mm -hmm. and then we had the Nintendo 64, so we just switched back and forth. Yeah, and then so all my friends got a 64, and I got a PlayStation 1. So, oh, well, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, and I was kind of the cool kid for having that. Uh, we, My mom got it at a, whoa, fell in the water. Can he swim? No, but he can walk. But he, yeah, he can walk. I see, is there anything secret under there? should be something behind yeah, the waterfall, of right? Of course. I guess we'll go take a look, take a peek. There's Treasure. nothing behind the waterfall. Uh, but yeah, my mom got it at a... Uh, not a garage sale. Oh yeah, she didn't get it at a garage sale. I don't remember where she got it from. She might have got it from a pawn shop. I think she did get it from a pawn shop. So it was stolen? Probably, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So she got a pretty good price with like a couple games. I remember Twisted Metal was one of them. And then Crash Bandicoot. Of course. And those are the only games we had for years and years and years, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we used to rent games whenever we get a little bit of money. 
I don't know Man, if this will end the level. Games was worth it back in the day. It was. Yep. All right. It's a beautiful world you created. It's a beautiful there. world, yeah. Uh, there's not really much that you can do in it, Mario. but I'm sure that all these things are going to get like improved. And yeah, what we're trying to do here, guys, is just kind of take a look at like the most popular ones. Oh, oh good shit. God. I'm liking this. Oh man, this is gonna be difficult, I can tell. What? Right. Oh, no nice. Way. Yeah, they did it. Oh, wow. All right. Do, do, do. <laughs> <laughs> There's no coins, though. They did points instead. It doesn't seem like there's any bad guys either. Yeah, there's no bad guys yet. They haven't done the logic for bad guys yet. <laughs> Wasn't there like a free <laughs> life somewhere around here? Yeah, there's like some clouds or something. Oh, I don't know if Mario has a life. Any lives in this. <laughs> Mario's got no life. He's got no life. Well, I mean, yeah, he just goes around stealing coins from the bad guys. This is my jam. <laughs> and the worst part is, is Mario's not really like... A vigilante or you know a Robin Hood character. It's not like he's stealing the coins from the bad guys and giving them to like the poor. That's true. He keeps them for himself and he buys like really what does he buy? pointless stuff. What with his coins? Yeah. Does he, he tries buy? to buy himself a life. Oh, like he uses true. money to get ladies and and uh, he can't get a lady. He keeps snatching his lady. <laughs> Keep trying to go in all these pipes. From Bowser. I, wasn't there a pipe you could go in on the early yeah. level? Yeah. Oh the oh the flag doesn't work though. Still though, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, oh, oh no! All right, so okay, I, maybe I you think gotta that's... go through the door and then jump off and do to death. Yeah, perhaps. But Mario's got no life. Dude, dude, that's great. Yeah, I mean, they did a great job here. I don't know if they're planning on creating like the whole world with it. Yeah, maybe. All right, I'm digging it. Thumbs up. Can't go wrong with Mario. You can't go wrong with Mario. It's one of the first games I played. Slayer Scrolls. An RPG. It's completed. Oh. You are a slayer. You slay men and beasts in exchange for gold. Begin your adventure. All episodes added. Sword not working. Bug fixed. Huge triangle. Okay. Reset progress to see new scenes. All right. So the scene you get random or something like that. Hmm. What's the? Is it oh, Skyrim. We can. Oh, well, it's got we like can view chapters. The, yeah, we can view the levels. That's neat. All right. We'll just play play. You are a slayer. You take on contracts called scrolls to slay men or beasts in exchange for gold. You have journeyed to the quaint stone wall town. You enter the door of Finn. The innkeeper here is especially adept at finding the best scrolls, offering the most gold. Slayer scrolls. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah. Good presentation so far. Ready to go. Like that was it. <laughs> All right, so it's first person. Okay. Oh, Got nice. Some Got some lanterns. physics here in the lanterns. I mean, Ooh. it's kind of weird that we're like Ooh. amazed at like the littlest stuff. And like, if you were playing this as like a rarely game, you'd be talking about how it's not not great. But because you know somebody created this, just a, a person don't in their house. Don't drink that. I'm a drink it, Jinx. But I don't know <laughs> how to drink it. Are you gonna get in it? Or just get in it? Sell a little bit of me. <laughs> Come by me, Juice. It's tasty. Oh. Okay, so we can talk to this guy. Welcome to the Dwarf Hen Slayer. See if he's got a scroll for us. He always does. Before you get started, you should know there's an assassin here for you. <gasps> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'll take care of him. He's the fat one. Hard to miss the lad. Remember, Slayer? No weapons in my inn and keep it quiet. A bar fight is not good for business. Oh, goodness. All right, so I like that you can, that he had it hidden from the start, the uh, controls. And right, so we can run with our L1. We, we can crouch. Him. Uh, L1 plus circle is a slide. Whoa. Whoa! That's a hell of a slide. Yeah, I like that. Fill the de the assassin's drink with something deadly. Oh. So we need to go get that. Then we will refill your beer. Can I pick it up? All right, so he's moved. Okay. So we're gonna go take this. Dip and sludge. Now I don't know why a bar has Poisonous some sludge, sludge poison sitting we there. We won't ask questions. Haha, -ha, fat twin. Look at his f pudgy little face, man. Haha. -ha. 
<laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, it only makes him sleep. That's great. Oh, where'd oh, he go? Oh. He's right there. He's sleeping. Stomp him. I did it. Stomp him. <laughs> Stomp on his fat ass belly. Do a little jig. All right. So I guess we can go get our scroll now. Yeah. We dealt with the assassin. Quick work, Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was no assassin, Dorf. The lad hadn't paid his tab in ages. A nap like that should teach him a lesson, <laughs> so he was an assassin. Uh, so, I'm gonna talk some shit. I understand, Slayer. Getting on your bad side is not good for business. And uh, what scroll do you have for me? This scroll comes from the Lord of Frostburg. A dragon plagues the northern mountains. The Lord's knights have burned alive by its fiery breath. Slay the dragon. Bring the dragon's tooth. Claim your gold. Simple oh, enough. Lord. Let's accept the scroll. But it's a dragon. I mean, <laughs> it depends on what kind of dragon it is, Jinx. True, it could be the cuddly kind. Mm-hmm. Leave the dwarf in. All right, so move on to the next level here. All right. Yeah, I'm digging this. I think they did a good job with it. Oh, we got our sword now as well. We can swing. Yeah. I can't. Apparently we'll can't swing. We'll slay everyone. Hmm. Maybe you can't swing it in the in the town, perhaps. Such floofy snow. Everybody moves out of the way for you. So do we need to leave? I wasn't paying attention to anything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's why we're so good at games, guys, because we never pay attention. All right, so we can leave here. Maybe we don't have a sword yet. Maybe we need to go purchase a sword. Maybe we should run around town, make maybe sure there's not like a store. Swing it inside the city. Limits. True. Yeah. Well, the bar guy said we couldn't. Oh, there's a snowman. The bar guy said we couldn't swing in the bar, so I was assuming we'll be able to swing once we got out. I Here. don't like the look of him. I think we should smack him. Take his and carrot. Snatch his nose. Eat it. <laughs> All right. Dip it in some ranch. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you think they got ranch here, Jinx? No, I prefer peanut butter with carrot. Really? Yeah. Ranch oh, is gross. I can't even eat peanut butter anymore, guys. One of the many things I can't eat. Uh, but we were, we'd be here all day if I talked about all the things I can't eat. <laughs> Basically, if it's not extremely bland and boring. Flavorless. Flavorless. Then I don't get to eat it no more. Alright, so let's leave Stonewall Town. And after day, well, you want to read this one first? After days of journey, you arrive at the northern mountains. As you climb the mountain, you reach a clearing. A dwarf waits here, an axe in hand, and a slain man below him. That's what I'm talking about. Jinx should just be reading all of them. That's what I feel, <laughs> but Jinx doesn't want to read them all. I get tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Welcome to Stedge's Mountain. To continue on your journey, you must pay Stedge's toll. Any questions of warning, you'll get the same answer as the poor sod below me. Uh, so, he wants to rob us. Like, I totally us. paid the tax when I came by here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm going to charm him. Charm. How uh -huh. does a handsome dwarf like That's you exactly end up what I'm here? Say. Why, mister, you ain't too bad looking yourself. <laughs> I had to go into like a southern <laughs> As to why I'm here, it's all started when I was nine. Lost my parents in an ancient mining accident. <laughs> I just threw an ancient in there. <laughs> Growing up on the streets of Dorfhold made me an angry man and a deadly one. Well, thanks for listening to this Dorf's tale. Go on your way now. Let me ponder my ways. <laughs> That's right. Ponder so your ways, Dorf. a little kindness in his life. Exactly. So we didn't have a sword yet. Oh, That's why we well, couldn't now swing. we have one. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know why we came here without a sword to kill a dragon, but... Oh, we were going to tickle him. Let's not think too much on it. Oh, tickle torture. Yeah. All right. Let's climb up the mountain. Maybe we should have fought him just you so we can... reach a valley on the mountainside. The smell of smoke and ash fills your lungs. The presence of fire would be comfort for your cold hands if it did not signal that a dragon is stirring. The piercing screech of a dragon causes you to slip off a cliff and drop your sword. <laughs> just cut that. That is a terrifying sound. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was saying maybe oh, we can get oh, it. Well, that's good. You got it back. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he wasn't able to start you with the sword for some reason. I don't know. I can't wait to make some sound effects. Yeah, for the games. Yeah. Look at her red hand. If anyone needs me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so 
Yeah, I really Where's feel like maybe chat? we should have found the dwarf so that we could have a little bit of experience in fighting. Violence is not always the answer. I want to find an apple. An apple. Oh, that is a huge apple. All right, push me oh, back no, a little bit. Oh, no, he's coming right for you. Good job. Yeah. Oh, he's closing off the way, Jinx. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. He's like, you shall not pass. How do you kill a dragon with a sword anyway? Smack him upside the head a couple times, Jinx. Of course. Yeah. Die, when you get behind him, beast. you just gotta stay out of his, his fire. Oh, he's breathing. got 932 health. Does he have a tail attack? Chop it off. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do, Jinx. Oh, I can't. I gotta get up and get to. I gotta chop his butt. Ah. Oh, man, the fire is spreading. <laughs> oh, my, it is. Oh, I think I died. Well, do we have to start all over, is my question. I would assume so. But yeah, my plan to get up close and stab <laughs> him in the butt did not work out well. Maybe I could have ate the apple. Like, oh. yeah, you really should go into a dragon fight with a bow. Come on. Or magic. Well, I mean, no, if whatever. the if the apple, or excuse me, if the uh, the oh. dragon is willing to come down to the ground. So you press down to eat the apple. And I, I'm guessing that increases our health. It's gonna get hot. Anyway, but yeah, quite impressed with the game, guys, just because... Yeah, like, the dragon's pretty like, I, I'm just always like, how much work does this take? So much work. All right, so we're having a little bit more effect in this. We did get burned by yeah. that. It's fine. We're getting down to health. We just have to remember <laughs> to eat the apple. Oh, he's almost down. Come on. We can do this. He's got less health than us oh, now. Oh, eat not it. Quite. Eat the apple. We did it. Let's just eat the apple just so oh, he's, we, he's we say we did. quite upset. Where'd he go? I don't think I killed him, Jinx. You just scare him off? You don't want none of this. Oh. Whoa. Oh, are we inside the dragon? Oh, oh, there he is. <laughs> he tried to fly away, but he died. Oh, take his tooth. Give me a tooth. Oh, there it is. Snitch. All right. Oh, we can eat that tooth, too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we did it. You carry the dragon's tooth and make the journey back to Stonewall Town. When you arrive, the gates don't open for you like usual. Guards come outside to confront you. They don't look too pleased to see you. I want to end it off here. Now we have to see what happens. Sorry, Slayer, you are no longer allowed inside Stonewall Tent. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was awesome, Jinx. Uh, see, that's what I'm talking about. She, does all, she should just do all her voice acting. I don't know if I can do it again. <laughs> <laughs> a fortnight ago, a slain, burn, ice fell village to the ground. Every man, woman, and child were slain. Slayers are no longer allowed in Stonewall. <laughs> that was that guy back there. It's All right, so game. I don't want to <laughs> completely play this. I don't want to focus, you know, just on one game, guys. We want to look at multiple games here. I mean, you uh, should have known when it said RPG. Yeah, it seems oh, like it keeps, keeps going for a little while. So, yeah, we're on this part right here, and we have a couple more levels. Oh. Favors. We've got to do favors. <laughs> okay, that might not be YouTube appropriate. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and exit here. But, oh, I don't want to reset my progress. I might want to come back to this. What I want to do is... No, I don't want to do that either. I want to thumbs up it. Let's exit the creation. Maybe. All right, let's get out of here. All right, we get leveled up as well from, from playing all these games. Oh, this is Metro. It's a visual benchmark. Kind of show what you can do in it or something? Maybe. Graphic-wise? I don't know. Fallen is early visual concept created on dreams. Whoa. Metro. Okay. Okay. All right. That's Very nice, I suppose. Very nice. So we can kind of change the view. The bubble bath engine? That was called? <laughs> That's what it is. That? On the bubble bath engine. It's okay. real time footage running on the bubble bath engine. All right. You know? <laughs> All right. So let's go and exit here. It's very pretty. Mm -hmm. uh, all of uh, anything you do with your your little guy here is controlled with the what is that called? The motion controls in the in the controller. The motion controls. I thought it had another name. <laughs> I'm sure it does, but we don't use it enough. Not to a working know what it is. portal gun. Paddle extreme. The encounter. That's a multiplayer game. Uh, it does have single player though. We'll play this. The encounter. Is this another visual adventure? That's the first time that 
he had a lady encounter him. Mm-hmm. Fall in love with a demo for Unclean Project plan for the production after the release of Dreams. It's currently being worked on, so you might experience minor bugs or glitches. Well, okay then. So this was, it must be at work. His first encounter with the lady was at work. <laughs> Getting some Half-Life vibes. A little bit. It's a heck of an elevator. Mm-hmm. Can we interact with anything here? Can we do anything? Is it a walking simulator? <gasps> a robot. Oh. Oh, there you are. Beep, boop, boop, boop. <laughs> I think it's finally time to leave this space station. Beep, boop, boop, boop. <laughs> <laughs> uh, something weird is going on. We better hurry. Beep, beep. <laughs> now we got Jinx over here doing the voice acting for the robot. It's got far more charisma than I thought it was going to have. All right, so can we go in there? No, nope, that's not a door you can go into. Walk forward. I think you gotta I use push the a button. Oh. oh no, he's gonna do it. Only robots can open doors in the future. Mm -hmm. Of course. You don't know the password, Jinx. I suppose that's true. Do you gotta open that one too? The password was Olympic banana. A weird password. Indeed. Alright, so I think if it's red, that means it's locked. So that one well, would be locked too. Well, we know the password. I have to open it manually in the control room. Okay. So how do we get up to the control room? Hmm. What do we do, robot? What do we do? Stack boxes. Can we go in this one? It's red too, so I was assuming it would be able to go into it. Oh, but it's nope. orange. I don't. Yeah, you ish. know what? I don't think the color does tell us. I think we need to go this way. Open that this area way. up there. Looked like the control room to me, if I've ever seen a control room, which I have, because I've been playing video games for a long time. <laughs> they all look the same. All right, trying to interact with something thus far. I think the robot has to do everything. Oh, no. oh, he doesn't know. He doesn't know He's either, James. Buttons. Oh no. I believe in you, robot. We can figure you this out this. together. Our powers combined. He's very confused. And anytime now, it? buddy. <laughs> Oh, that's not right. Oh, it's super dark in here. Yeah, it is. I'm liking the view out there. There could be a few uh -oh. more stars. Did he leave us? Oh, wh whoa, what's going oh, on? Oh, no. Did we grow? No, no, <laughs> it just, uh, the camera pulled back. Because you can, uh, you know, just for any cut scenes and all that kind of good stuff, you can kind of control the camera. And I was expecting there to be a giant monster or something. Running into some problems. Well, at least we don't have to wait on the robot to open that one. There's a ship. Let us get out of here. What could go wrong? All right, so we're trying to hop into the ship. Oh, look at that uh, moon over there. Is that, that might be a planet and then that's the moon next to it. Yeah, that's cool. The playable demo ends here, but we'll update it soon. Feel free to explore. Okay, so that's what it, what they've done so far. All right. I mean, it, it they look like they've done a good job. Yeah. Part of this is, you know, you're able to clone all the items, so you really only mm -hmm. need to create something once, and then you can clone it again over and over again, which is super helpful. I uh, just haven't. still. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's still, I mean, Getting the amount of to work look just right. this probably took. Yeah, I can't even imagine. It's like thumbs up. Good job. Good job, mate. Mar marvelous. Marvelous. I'm guessing it's got marbles. <laughs> well, if they roll, then that will be fantastic. All right, it's a new game. And we have to collect coins. Green grass grow. So yes, we are a marble. This is Sonic, yeah, yo. Yeah, <laughs> I know, right? I was just about to say that. I'm getting some strong Sonic vibes. But it's coins instead of <laughs> uh, the rings. You're just a ball. Oh man, there's a ramp. Ooh, Ooh treasure. treasure. Oh, what? you need 15 coins? What kind of treasure chest needs fucking coins? Can we jump? We can jump. It's a special ball. Everything's so fuzzy. Is that the end of the level? 
No. You need all the coins. All right, so we need to get 15 coins. Let's see if we can't collect them here. Need to power up. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jinx's sound effects. Great, guys. We almost have all the coins. And there's one more Is somewhere. Is that the big red oh, coin? Oh. Snap, crack a we got to ramp it. Yeah, I think we just oh, need to go damn. get that coin yeah, right I there, guess Jinx. that's all you need. There's also coins over here. We could probably grab up. Whoa. Oh, what? I fell. Yeah, I just love <laughs> the textures. Oh, come on. And yeah, you can kind of change the textures however you want. It's not really a marble. It's more like a little fuzz ball. <laughs> What's the button do? Oh. Please be a cannon. That looks like a cannon. <laughs> well, let's go get our treasure first. Whee! Oh, did I oh, miss no. some? Oh, I fell in the water. At least oh, we didn't keep lose our... anything. Maybe we can keep our coins. Oh, yeah, oh, that's a ramp. that's one of those boingers. A boinger? <laughs> yeah, what you know, it boings you. you. Makes you go real fast up the ramp. All right, so we can open the chest. 15 coins, let's do it. What'd we get? Oh, we got an item. What did so, you get? What they can do is they can let you have their items that they made. Oh. And that you can only get the items they made by doing, you know, by finding them, basically. Okay, so the little bubble thing's kind of like little big planet that you gather yeah, and create. Yeah, exactly, your... Jinx. I mean, this is kind of... I need to, like, do it just right. It's just kind of hard. Yeah. You need to back into it. You gotta get the camera just right so you see what you're doing. Yeah, exactly. So we need to like be very careful here. Back into it and it's a big fine nope. blue ball. Won't you back that thing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we did it. <laughs> right, so let's see if I can stay up here because I don't want to do that again. Yeah. <laughs> and then it looks like that's another. This cannon. level is way bigger than I thought it was. And there's a lot to it. Like I didn't even think. To Whoa! Pick it's up. bouncy. Whoa! Oh no! Ah! Oh, oh, fuck. That was luck. <laughs> it wasn't luck. That was skills, Jinx. Skills. Yeah. I think that these are checkpoints, the little red balloons. Oh, okay. I hope so, anyway. Yeah, because that would be a pain to have to do all that over again. It does suck that we didn't get the item that is, is down there, though. Yeah. But I don't want to jump back That's down there. Fine. But if we fall, we'll grab it. Ah. Come on. By George, we did it! Whoa! <laughs> this is nail biting. <laughs> Life is rough as a ball, Jinx. I imagine it would be. Mm hmm. Like, how do you control yourself? Oh, that looks like a disaster zone. Oh, Don't these spikes. Yeah, those shoot you up. Whoa. I was just thinking that it was going to be like a fun house where you get to, you know, bounce all over the as, damn as a place, ball. But, yeah. You know, it's a fun house of death. I think they did a great job with this. Yeah, they did. Whoa. Whoa. Careful now. <laughs> I grabbed that checkpoint up, which I'm assuming once again that that's checkpoint. I missed one. Another button. And? Oh, man. Okay, so I got those moving. So we're gonna have to go back that way. Oh, oh. but how convenient. This is oh, there's really a, nice. Yeah, they did a great job with this. Uh, I noticed a treasure chest over here as well. So let's open it up. I think that's the main purpose of the coins. To get goodies. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got the coin. All right, so we can use the coin if we wanted to. Can I get up here? Oh, that would be cheaty. <laughs> well, because it kind of feels like there might be something up there that you can get to. Oh, whoa. Almost fought, rolled right off, guys. Walk the plank. All right. The glowy area, the end. Hmm? Yeah, I think that's the end up there. So, because okay. he did such a great job and I want to unlock all his items, <laughs> I'm willing to do that pain in the like, butt part again. Give me all again. your goodies. Okay, so that was a red tile or something. Or maybe these. Oh, we didn't get that coin right there. I don't know if you need to get all the coins to unlock everything, so I'm just gonna maybe. like assume that you do. I don't know if I'm being timed on this either, but I don't care. It doesn't care. seem like it. I mean, there it doesn't show a timer, so. Oh, you fucking kidding me. <laughs> and I already rolled all the way over here, guys, so I have to get it. He's got to get the coin. I'm a little bit of a completionist sometimes, guys. He can be. Yeah, it can get kind of bad sometimes. And he just loves coins, so. God damn it. All right, I'm not going to do it, guys. I won't make you sit <laughs> through it. But I'm going to get... Oh, that's not a coin. 
All right, so let's try and do this one again. Though, is there any way to like avoid doing it? No, there's no Can way Can you go through it. the door? I don't know. Is it open? I don't know. Whee! Whoa, all right, that wasn't that bad. All right, so let's use this thing again. Ah! <laughs> oh. Whoa, nice save. All right, let's see if we can't do oh, this. Oh, I feel like that's too far. I feel like that one game that we played uh, with the the Play-Doh, the Play-Doh game, what the hell was oh, that called? Oh, Clay Book Clay or Book. something like that. I'm having like a terrible job today remembering like the names of stuff. I've forgotten the name of everything I've tried to say <laughs> so far today. I feel like that has kind of prepared me for being in a ball, guys. All right, so I'm, I think I finished it. I don't know if there's any of the levels. It did say level selection. You acquired Growl. Press triangle glow. to use it. Oh, glow. <laughs> I thought it was oh, Growl. Oh, we gotta use it to glow on the thing. Oh, We're a glow ball. I am so Just when we think the light, game is man. over, it gets better. Well, it said there's levels, so I'm like expecting. Ah, I'm just wow. glowing. Oh, no. Please have the glow. Yeah, we still got okay. the glow. Gotta have so that glow. where does it want us to glow? Over there on that platform. Oh, that one. I was wondering what that was for. Everything ah. has a purpose, guys. Hey, nice job. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's do a little bit of glow in here. And we did it. We opened the doors. What a great little game. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I want to see how many levels there are. Are there more, you think? So it had a level selection screen. Oh. So maybe. I guess we'll find out now. Well, we're glowy, so it might be a dark level. Level two, yeah. Crystal cave. It's the crystal cave. So maybe we'll do this one last level here, guys. Like, again, I don't want to spend all of our time well it does look like oh, oh okay well, that that's is bad. so you need to use your glow to be able Follow to see anything oh look at this this is super creative okay all right this is how you get them coins be very oh, oh we lit it up. up the place beautiful oh ah <laughs> the goo the goo at least it saves everything you did ruins our fuzz <laughs> <laughs> I had to get the coin, guys. Probably could have got it and got across if yeah. I was more competent, but you know. Like if you did like a kick flip. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So this is, I think this is a good look. I want to take a look at like one more game before we end the, the video here. Uh, probably something kind of short. But yeah, I think this definitely deserves a thumbs up. That was fantastic. Good yeah, times. that was one of my favorite. Yeah, I think that was great. Solid, Solid gears. gears are metal. <laughs> short stealth level. All right, that's great. So it's like a Metal Gear Solid type of thing. Are we a box? <laughs> <laughs> we better be a box. If I don't want to have the ability to turn into a box. Reach the end without being detected. The white light roughly represents the enemy's vision. Roughly. Oh, we can... <laughs> can I see the controls? No, it's just naked. Awkwardly. All right, press X to switch between prone and standing. Oh, you can crawl through. Mm-hmm. Oh, Metal Gear Solid Jinx, you gotta be able to crawl. The Jinx is, oh, oh no. they caught me. So Jinx has never played a, a Metal Gear Solid game. I really haven't. I've played all of them, I think. Yeah. yeah, I watched you play parts of some of them. I didn't play much of the last one though, guys. I know that's terrible, because the last one was one of the better ones. Oh, oh no. Shit. I played it though, I just didn't get He's coming as for far you. as I would have liked to have. Well, we did a few videos for the channel. We did do a couple videos. A long time ago, I went to Jessica watching those because it was so, <laughs> so long ago. So yeah, we need to go into this little corner and then break his neck. <laughs> Give him the old Judy chop. Interrogate him. <laughs> tie a See what he to knows. Yep, and then tie a balloon to him so we bring him back to our camp. Now that one I would have played. Just to tie balloons to butt. And to, to, yeah, you can get like uh, animals critters. and stuff and critters. Oh. Those stairs are hard. The stairs are hard. Oh, cameras. That's the checkpoint. I was wondering what that was. Whoa, stairs are so oh, hard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I made some stairs in the tutorial. My stairs are pretty garbage too, so I can understand. <laughs> My stairs didn't work properly. <laughs> as long as it gets you up to the next level, then they do their <laughs> job. I couldn't walk up though. I had to jump up them. Oh. oh man, huh? So you just need to like walk around them like that. 
And I'm oh, guessing that man. guy flips back and yeah. forth. Oh, he kind of flips he's, around sporadically. Yeah, he's a little bit uh, unpredictable. The type. Oh, those ones are running. Oh shit! All right, checkpoint. All right, so we got some running ones. <laughs> it's important to stay oh, in shape. Oh, ah, You gotta do a figure eight. Whoa! Ah, I don't know what they're doing. They're crazy. Come on, we can get out of here. All right, so let's go in here. It. I think it's really cool that you can represent where the enemies can see you. Oh, he got me. Oh, then oh we gotta go all the way no. back here, though. Gotta deal with these jerks. So he goes that way. I guess that's not really fair. They could be really nice little guys. They're just doing their job, Jinx. Or oh, that are one's they? sleeping. Oh, okay. I wonder if you could go in there. Nah, I mean, it had the ball Yeah. There. So what sucks here is that you have to, like, see where he's looking when you come out. Go, go, go. Woo! You did it. Oh, camera. camera. Space in the wall. All right, did we do it? Yeah. Looks like we completed it. All right. Metal Super Gear Solid. Sneaky. Thumbs up, man. I like Metal Gear Solid. That's what you gotta do. You gotta prey on people's love mm -hmm. of other games. Well, like little big plan. We're just gonna <laughs> scroll through these because yeah, this is gonna be the end of the, the episode, guys. Uh, but this is definitely something I would like to do more of, uh, especially as more and more games get created uh, now that it is on oh, early access. Cool. And so a lot of people have access to this game now. Uh, before it was just a select few people in the betas. And uh, now that there's a wider uh, group of people that have access to it, I think we're going to see more and more cool stuff uh, happening here. Yeah, like some of these, I feel like we really missed opportunity not checking these out. But the video is already long enough. So let us know what you guys think down in the comments below. Well, depending on how the views go, uh, how you guys feel about the video, maybe we'll do some more of this, checking out some of the games. Uh, in addition to checking out the games, guys, I, I definitely want to go into the dream shaping a bit in a, in a later video uh, and maybe do some creation of our own. Playing around. Yeah, I think that could be really fun. Oh, and at you. This he always talks to me. <laughs> your creativity grows and evolves. Because I'm leveling up. Will change to reflect your activities. You can become a specialist at one aspect of dreams or dabble in every area as you like. It can also help others find you so you can combine your talents and make something amazing together. So I'm gonna hit level five, and I think when you hit level five, then it uh, creates like a little profile for you to kind of decide like, yeah, I hit level five now. So it kind of tells about you. Oh. Uh, so I'm an explorer of digital worlds. You may not spend all of your time playing, but but it's what you, makes you special in the Dreamverse. Without you, our Dreamcrafters would have no audience. We salute you. Well, how nice. Yeah, so it kind of like, you know, explains. And as you level up, it, you know, tells more about you. You know, whether you're a, you know, a creator uh, or, you know, a do a, a dabbler, you know, where you do a little bit of everything or a player. Uh, yeah, uh, so kind of interesting little thing kind of tells about you. Uh, so... So yeah, definitely something that we would like to continue exploring, guys. I'm digging this game. I'm super excited about it. Uh, both Jinx and I would like to do a little bit of game creation ourselves. Uh, both very creative and have a lot of ideals in our head on, on what we'd want to do. Of course, whether our ideals are, our ideals are <laughs> going to be limited by our abilities or uh, you know another matter. But we'll have to see, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Enjoyed the games that we took a look at. Uh, kind of showed you what's available right now in the store. Once again, these are just the beta uh, people, so we're going to see more and more games popping up. Uh, and then this is just the early access version. The uh, final version, when it comes out, is going to have uh, levels crafted by the developers. They have a whole story mode, uh, which is not in the early access version. So we couldn't really show that off or anything. So when the game officially releases, you definitely see us popping back in here and taking a look at the actual story mode and of the, the game. Early access, so right now it was 30 US dollars? $30. From my understanding, it's supposed to get more expensive when it once officially it released. officially releases. Yeah. Uh, so this is kind of like, you know, for the creators to make stuff so that when it officially relates or, or releases, uh, I don't know if all the content will still be on the store because they did make a little warning that some stuff might get deleted or might not make it or whatever. Uh, so I don't know if it'll all still be available. But the point is, is that you get people experienced with the, you know, creators experienced with the tools, learn how to make make games. Uh, so, you know, definitely going to be seeing more of dreams on our channel in time. 
Uh, but hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. Hope to see you on another one of our videos, which you can find on the front page of our channel. We play a ton of different games, so you should be able to find something that you enjoy. Uh, in addition to that, uh, any links uh, that you may be looking for should be found in the description of any of our videos. That's, you know, links to our social media, uh, you know, like Twitter, Facebook. you also find uh, links to our uh, Patreon and PayPal if you want to support the channel. And finally, there is a link to our Discord channel if you'd like to come join us and some of our other subscribers and have all kinds of pretty cool conversations there. We have a, a good uh, little community. Uh, so we'd love to see you there as well. Uh, so yeah, once again, hope to see you on another video and thanks for watching guys.